Today, we're embarking on an intriguing journey. What happens if you only eat meat for 30 days? The carnivore diet, characterized by its exclusive focus on meat, has been gaining attention. Advocates claim it can lead to weight loss, improved mental clarity, and other health benefits. But is it sustainable? And what could the potential consequences be? As we kick off week one, the transition to an all-meat diet can be both exciting and challenging. Meat becomes your primary source of nutrients, bidding farewell to carbohydrates, fruits, and vegetables. Initial experiences may include increased energy levels due to the absence of sugar crashes and a shift in metabolic processes. But hey, let's not forget about the potential carnivore flu, where your body is adjusting to the significant shift in eating habits. It's a week of culinary exploration as you discover the multitude of ways to enjoy meats, from juicy steaks to savory meat stews. As we venture into weeks two and three, something interesting starts happening. Your body begins to adapt. Some people notice weight loss as their bodies enter a state of ketosis, burning stored fat for fuel. Improved mental clarity and focus might start to emerge thanks to stabilized blood sugar levels. However, the lack of fiber may lead to changes in your bathroom routine, and the absence of certain nutrients from fruits and vegetables may prompt questions about long-term sustainability. In the latter part of our journey, let's delve into the mental side of things. Some participants report elevated mood and reduced inflammation, while others may experience challenges in maintaining social connections due to dietary restrictions. The long-term impact of an all-meat diet on mental health remains a subject of curiosity and debate among experts. It's not just about what you eat, but how your mind reacts to this unique nutritional journey. Now let's break down the impact. What really happens to your body during this all-meat extravaganza? On the positive side, potential benefits may include weight loss, improved energy, and mental clarity. However, concerns arise about nutrient deficiencies, particularly in vitamins and minerals found in fruits and vegetables. And let's not forget the potential strain on the digestive system due to the absence of fiber. As we conclude our carnivore journey, the key takeaway lies in mindfulness and balance. While the carnivore challenge can provide insights into the body's adaptability, it's crucial to approach it with caution, consulting with healthcare professionals, incorporating a variety of nutrient-dense foods, and listening to your body's signals are essential aspects of any dietary exploration. Whether you're intrigued, skeptical, or somewhere in between, Remember that our bodies are unique and what works for one may not work for another. If you found this journey enlightening, don't forget to hit that like button, share your thoughts in the comments, and subscribe for more adventures in health and nutrition. Until next time, stay curious, stay healthy, and keep exploring.